Let's create a denial of service policy and see how that looks in Wireshark. To get more easy setup tips for your 48 firewall, subscribe now and don't forget to click on the bell notification and you won't miss anything. In the following scenario, we will use a denial of service policy. We will try to create a denial of service attack towards our gateway interface, and we will capture it using Wireshark. So we have one of our interfaces, which is the marketing interface at the 10.0.4.0 subnet. The gateway interface itself is 10.0.4.1 and our DHCP client, which is the Ubuntu device, is at 10.0.4.9. So let's move to our Ubuntu device. All right. Let's just, let's just clear that. Let's try to ping our gateway, 10.0.4.1. Everything goes well. The, um, the rate is very slow using the uh, casual ping command. So let's uh, stop that. And now let's create our denial of service policy. And then we will use the hyphen F using our pseudo credentials to create a flood of ICMPs. Um, all right, so policy and objects, denial of service policy, create new policy. We are protecting our marketing uh, subnet. Let's use for source, we can use specific devices, but let's use source and destination all, service all. And now let's move over to layer four anomalies, ICMP flood, there it is. Enable it, block it, and let's set the threshold to 20 ICMP packets per second. So what we will see um, once we do it and try to ping our gateway interface is that only 20 uh, packets will get a response back and the other ones not. So let's move to our Ubuntu device. Before that, let's just start capturing using your, sorry for that, capture using Wireshark. All right. Let's, let's move. Now, using the pseudo credentials with the ping command and the hyphen F, the dash F, which is a float, we are sending hundreds of ICMP packets towards our destination. So let's just ping it. As you can see, it runs very fast. Let's wait a while and let's stop it. Now you can see that only 20 packets, that's the threshold, only 20 packets were received. The other 96 packets were lost due to our denial of service policy. Now let's move to Wireshark. Let's stop the capture. Now let's apply the filter ip.addr equals equals 10.0.4.9 and ICMP. We can see that we have a request and a reply for the first 20 packets. Following that, we only have echo requests that were sent from our Ubuntu device, but they are not acknowledged and we don't have a response. Moving back to our 48, we can head to login report and look for anomaly and there we can see uh, the record for our ICMP flowed attack for our denial of service 
uh, attack and we can see that we have an anomaly which is an ICMP float with a threshold of 20 packets only.